unfortunately, <coughs> excuse me, I am a smoker, but it has come in handy. If I turn around, turn too far, no, it didn't turn far enough. You'll see behind me there is one of my goats. I've got to finish working on this fence that is in my to-do list so I can get, whoa, bright sunlight. Let me move over a little bit, get you guys out of the sun. There, now we can see. But I've got the fence post, I've got most of the fence, and usually I don't smoke on camera, but I have a problem with the goats aggravating me all the time. They always want to come up and do their talking to me, like I can really understand them. But I hold Goat Be Gone, simple little firecracker. Stick it to the end of my cigarette, toss the thing, it makes a boom, they run. I ain't got to worry about it for five or ten minutes. But I came on to make a short video because I've got some new subscribers lately. I'm trying to figure out where the, there's the camera thing, now I can look at it. And I wanted to thank all of you guys, personally, for subscribing. And these channels are Memphis Mower. Let me not be rude and talk with my mouth full. <coughs> Out West Homestead. Journey Back to Basics. Living Faith Homestead. Johnny Gooch. Peanuts Peppers. Wild Edibles. Striving for the Simple Life. I appreciate you guys supporting me and subscribing to my channel. A couple of you I already checked out and I liked what I saw and it's getting a little chilly. That's why the camera's so shaky. I'm starting to, I got to move back in the sun. It's a little bright, I don't know guys, but <laughs> I can't help it. It's chilly. Even in South Georgia, it does get kind of, kind of chilly. But I appreciate you guys for subbing to my channel and um, that gives me more encouragement to actually get off my behind as I'm looking for a job in my spare time I need to be out here doing this stuff because as we walk by you'll see my chicken pen that the goats have you'll see how they so graciously rubbed themselves all over it and knocked all the wire off of the, the T-posts well, turn around that way, you can't see me. I picked the wrong time of the day to come out and do this. I should have done it earlier. But I had to do a little grocery shopping with a little bit of money I made. I refinished cast iron cookware for people and I had a lady that had, well, this was her second time around, $10 a piece to refinish a cast iron frying pan. It's not a bad price because even the cheapest lodge that you can buy at Walmart's $14 for the smallest pan you know and the stuff I sell is guaranteed vintage American made milled bottom it ain't got that sand that sand grainy texture to it and when I'm done with it I do it the old-fashioned way with lard when I'm done to it cheese won't stick to it no matter how long you fry it the original non-stick cookware and if anybody has a particular piece that they're looking for, if they collect cast iron, I may have it. Just ask me. If so, it could be for sale. I've only got about 70 of them or so hanging on a wall, which eventually when I get that room made into a studio to do my live chats, you'll be seeing a lot of it. And um, as a matter of fact, if this gets uploaded, because I have a very slow upload time, it takes it took 12 hours to get my last video up. I'm only on 6 meg download. I got the cheapest internet I could where I am. And, you know, just trying to make ends meet till I find the job where I can afford better. And having to do this on a phone instead of a camera. But um, 
I just wanted to say thank you for the support. You'll be seeing a lot more videos in the future. And I'll be going over a lot of other things. Tomorrow night I plan on having a live stream at 9 o'clock Eastern Time. That Sunday the 16th. 9 o'clock Eastern Time. Some things I'm seeing in the grocery stores concerning agriculture. Such as beans and dry beans and things like that. And prices of meat and, and the reasons why. Along with just general conversations we go from everything from gardening to politics to you name it you want to talk about it we'll talk about it you're not going to hurt my feelings and most of the people that subscribe to me you're not going to hurt theirs either because we're all god-fearing christians and most of us are gun-toting americans and we believe in the second amendment and we believe in our gardens and family faith and food are our main priorities. So call us preppers, call us homesteaders, whatever, however you want to describe it, that's what we are. But anyway, I wanted to personally thank these channels for subscribing over the last week or so. And I, I will put this video up as soon as I'm through recording it. I don't do much editing. I don't do much fancy stuff. It's just what you see is what you get with me. <coughs> and... Feel free to give yourself a shout out for your channel so maybe somebody else will see it and, and they'll like what you do and, and they'll give you a sub. I have no problem at all with that. And again, thank you very much for supporting my channel. And I look forward to putting up more videos as soon as I can. God bless you and we'll talk to you soon. Video project number one after this video <clears throat> all of this winter I didn't have a garden growing in this area it's overgrown with winter weeds that I need to till under but the tiller needs a new air filter and a spark plug which I have and I just need to get around to changing it it's a little chilly and I've been feeling a little under the weather lately so I haven't gotten to it 